Welcome back. It's the climax of the 2019 Britain's Strongest Man. With only the Atlas Stones to come, Adam Bishop lies just two and a half points behind leader Graham Hicks. Can Hicksy hang on for his first title? I just gotta get myself fired up and do what needs to be done. In third place currently is Scotland's Tom Stoltman, hoping to consolidate his first ever podium finish. The Stones then, five to be lifted, with weights increasing from 100 to 180 kilos and just 60 seconds to complete them. Over to Danny and Colin. Yes, there we are before makeup. Not really, that's Paul Smith managed five stones in 27.37 seconds. And Mark Felix did even better, 23.96 seconds. Worshipped by the crowd for that. Will this be his retirement? We don't know. All I know is this is a very long shot. We move on then to Terry Hollands. Up against, well, just that <laughs> giant of a man. The first of today's Stoltmans. The plural of Stoltman, actually, is Stoltmen. Do you know that, Colin? What's the plural of Hollands, then? No one knows. But here we go. The two big men facing off, and we're off. Terry Hollands, that little bit taller. Luke Stoltman, the power, though, he has won this event before, and Britain's strongest man, as he said, and he's looking good here. This is a very fast performance here from Stoltman, 23.96 to beat, just Ooh. struggling now. Got it stuck in the way up there. 24 seconds are thereabouts to beat. Very close. Wow, look at that. Yes, 23.43 seconds. Half a second or so faster. Could have been a second and a half faster if he hadn't have fluffed it there. Big Terry finishes off not too badly either. Times when the hands come off, remember. Well, here's a battle for the podium. Charley, currently in third position overall. Up against the second of our Stolt men, also third overall. What a physique. Thank you. Oh. And Tom Stoltman, too. <laughs> two metres, two. Look at that! Just tears it off the ground like it's nothing. Charley looking pedestrian next to him. 23.43, the time to beat now. This, and he's going to annihilate it! This is incredible. Look at this from Stoltman. Absolutely amazing time. Five stones, 18.03 seconds. Charley, still a good time. Very good time, but... Uh, it's almost 10 seconds slower than Tom Stolman. Well, he's got to be happy with that. Qualifies for World's Strongest Man, of course, and takes his place on the podium. The first Scot since 2003. Gregor Edmonds managed it. Well, he's 24 years old, and there hasn't been a Scot who's won Britain's Strongest Man in his lifetime. Forbes Cowan, 95, and he could be the next one, Danny. Well, these two have been battling each other all day. Yes, Adam Bishop on the left there from Hampshire. Graham Hicks on the right from Lancashire, who's got that two and a half point lead. All he's got to do, Hicksy, is beat Mark Felix's time of about 23.9 seconds. And even if Bishop wins, Hicks will win Britain's Strongest Man. A nervous Mrs. Hicks. And they're off. Well, I expect Bishop to win this. He's the taller man, he's very explosive, but Hicksy's staying with him. Well, the 18.03 is the time to beat. Even if Bishop beats that, though, Hicksy just has to beat 23.96. He looks like he's going to do that. And he does. Well, Bishop manages it in 21.46, but Hicks manages 22.58, so he's done enough to become Britain's strongest man. And he's wanted this for so long. He's just been getting better and better over the past few years. And now he's done enough. With the Atlas Stones, Tom Stoltman stormed ahead, 18.03 seconds. Bishop in second. And Hicks not getting enough points to secure his position. 
Adam Bishop, yeah, I did back him to win today. And, uh, he, you know, he's had a few slip ups, but again, it's what you do on the day. So Graham is the winner and well deserved. Thank you very much, Eddie. Graham, three times on the podium, you've now become Britain's strongest man. You said you dreamt of it. You've now achieved your dream. How does that feel? It's amazing, you know. You know, I, I said, I'll say to Colin that 2016, I was injured and I, I gave up strongman. You know, I, I was six months, I didn't train, you know, and I, I gave it a goal back in 2017. I came third. Last year, I came second. This year, barely, I came first. So. From injured to third, second, first, it's, it's a good story, you know. I never ever dreamed of it, so uh, amazing. And now you get to do it in front of your son and your family. Oh, he is absolutely my biggest fan. I mean, he doesn't want cartoons on TV, he wants strong man. He loves it, so so I'll give it back to my wife. Thanks. Congratulations. Well, there you go, the final standings, and Graham Hicks. 54.5 points makes him Britain's strongest man. Great work from Bishop, and of course, the stolt men. The passing of the torch then from Eddie to Graham. Graham Hicks, Britain's strongest man. And you know what that means? Oh, yeah, you do. Tell us, Danny. Well, it's the first show of the season, Colin. What do we do at the end of these shows? We finish with a montage. A montage.